Yeah, Richard Clarity, the new vice chairman for the Federal Reserve, uh, in what I consider a somewhat dovish speech, and I'll get to that in a second, says rate hikes are still necessary, uh, but the real funds rate is, quote, just below the Fed's longer run estimate. We'll get back to that in a second as well. The Fed is monitoring the data to decide the, quote, ultimate destination for the policy rate. It calls U.S. economic fundamentals robust, says the labor market's healthy, notes that 2018 is on track to be the fastest growth of GDP of this expansion, inflation running at or near the 2% objective. He's checking the boxes here. Uh, important to watch inflation expectations, he said. Notes that the tips market is suggesting inflation expectations are running below 2%. Says productivity is increasing the supply side of the economy, which means we can run perhaps above what they consider to be trend. Also says there's still room for a higher job market uh, participation or job market participation says the Fed needs to monitor a wide range of data and risks are more symmetric. I want to get to what Clarida didn't say and what he changed compared to both, uh, say, his October 25th sheet. He omitted saying, quote, further rate hikes are likely appropriate. He omitted saying monetary policy is still accommodative. And he changed saying the real funds rate is below neutral, saying just below neutral. So I am sort of sensing here perhaps a somewhat dovish tilt, maybe not for December. I can't yet, with the market at 80 percent probability, I, I don't see the Fed backing off December, but I think a lot of 2019 is up in the air. We'll hear from Powell tomorrow. Question for the market is, does Powell push pause? Not, you know, I don't yeah. think he's going to push pause Is there pause any way December. December's up in the air? No. I don't think so. No.